Want to go upstairs and get a head start on our honeymoon? You keep rubbing up against me, I'll be able to catch my mom's garter without my hands. <laughs> oh, watch your elbow. That's not my elbow. Oh, Charlie. It's not that either. Daddy? Ooh, this is awkward. What's going on? Teddy's dead. Yeah, that's a stiffy. <laughs> We have got a real problem here. What do you mean, we? <laughs> so who do you suppose will smoke in Teddy's sausage? <laughs> Rudolph, that is my father in there. Okay, so who do you suppose will smoke in your father's sausage? Interesting. We've got some perimortem ecchymosis on the posterior occiput. That means a bruise on the back of the head. And yet you still couldn't get into medical school. So much for time of death. Looks like our boy here had some sexual activity before he bought it. Hit the light. I'm going to check for semen. <laughs> uh -oh. My God. It's like a Jackson Pollock painting. The ceiling fan's actually a cute story. So, Mr. Harper. Call me Charlie. And you are? Interested in how you found the body. Oh, right to it, huh? <laughs> okay, well, what have you heard? That's not how we do this. You tell me what happened. All right. I went upstairs to use the bathroom, and there he was. Oh, no. <laughs> Teddy. So you're saying you were alone when you found him? Well, technically, aren't we all alone? <laughs> you know, I'm finding that tank top awfully distracting. <laughs> Is that police issue? I'm warning you, coffee tends to shoot through me. So if you've got a cavity search plan, you better do it pretty quick. We don't need to do a cavity search. Can I request one? You can't blame him. You gotta figure that boinking Evelyn's like riding a bicycle over train tracks. You'll get where you're going, but you're gonna feel every bump. What I want to know is, were you in your uncle's room at any time today? No, I never go in my uncle's room. Why not? Because all the skin mags are in my dad's room. <laughs> okay, let me just start out by saying I know about the illegal left turn ticket. And I, I, I've been meaning to take care of it, but, you know, business has been a little slow, and those bills just keep coming. Of course, I don't have to tell you that. <laughs> Our law enforcement personnel are woefully underpaid. Thank you for the coffee, by the way. Mmm. <laughs> Cops and truck drivers, you know your coffee. Am I going to jail? So you were happy he married your mother? Are you kidding? I was thrilled. I planned the wedding, and it went great. The reception, not so much. Why? What happened? The groom died. Remember? Do you need to write that down? who might have wanted him dead? No, no, everybody loved Teddy. And, and he was so good to my mom. It's, it's a shame she has to bury another husband. Another husband? Yeah, um, well, she's, you know, had a bit of bad luck in the dead spouse department. <laughs> Not that you can have good luck in the dead spouse department. <laughs> can I have some more coffee? Who ratted me out? Was it Alan? Oh, it doesn't matter. Either one of them would throw me under a bus for an Eskimo pie. <laughs> I want a lawyer. Hi, Charlie. Hey, Charlie. Hi, Charlie. Hi, Alan. Hey, I'm not the one who's got a dead husband with someone else's lipstick on his dipstick. I don't believe it. She used me. She scammed me. She took my money. Courtney. 
What? I'll wait for you. 